All right, I have to make an update to my Waymo, okay? And why I'm back with Uber and why I prefer Uber. So, I'm in a Mexican Uber in Mexico City. This is an electric car. It's a, a Jax or something like that. It's like a race car with a driver who picked up my suitcase and put it in the trunk. But the trunk is the reason why I'm like leery of Waymo, okay? Like, I thought it was a great thing until we got to the airport and I was at the wrong terminal. And then I couldn't get my bags out of the trunk. And I had to go on, I had to go to call tech support on the car to get them to give me my bags out of the trunk because I couldn't get them out of the trunk. The trunk wouldn't open. Oh, you know, and I was at the wrong terminal. It took me to terminal three in Phoenix airport instead of terminal four. Why would it do that? I have no idea. So, it's me Cinturon. Yes, yes, yes. So, it's finito. Okay. So, my Waymo, my great Waymo experience was besmirched by the trunk and by the wrong terminal. And, you know, it's like when you're dealing with Federal Express, once you deviate from their system, you're screwed. And it's the same thing with Waymo. It's like, Waymo can only do what Waymo can do. It can't do anything special. Unless you're really good at using Waymo. And I'm not, I'm just a novice. So, I did like not having any anybody else in the car. I thought that was cool. But hey, I really like this electric race car in Mexico City. <laughs> Some car just went right through the red light. See, in Mexico City, in Mexico, red lights are just, there's another car just going straight through. <laughs> no es un luz rojo. <laughs> Now we're gonna go, finally. After two cars just blew the red light, we're going through. So, I tell you, there is nothing better, transportation-wise, than Uber in Mexico City. That's as, as good as Waymo is in Phoenix, and it's, it's pretty good. Uber in Mexico City is the best.